of Big Red Fish Dad YouTube channel. Uh, today, uh, we were going to get some base, uh, road base for some of the holes down there uh, that wash out in the rain on the hill. And uh, we decided, you know, that the dirt gets caught in the in between these angle irons here. And so we just went and got some 2 by 12s um, And we're going to put a little kind of cage in here, whatever you want to call it, some boards to prevent that tarp from falling in back here. So um, all I'm doing is going to put a bolt right here and a bolt right here. That way it can be easily removable. And um, same thing up front, we'll just put a bolt and on the other side. And then Back here, let me take you around. We're gonna bolt us a piece of angle iron to the back of the front or whatever of this. So that way we can have like a little tailgate type thing. And um, you know, so we'll just be able to put our board, um, you know, our extra two by 12 back here and we'll have a piece of angle iron uh, screwed to this or bolted or whatever. So that way we'll have like a little, you know, kind of dump trailer-ish, you know, it's kind of some sides, like we have on our little uh, lawnmower trailer. So, uh, I'll just get to work, and y'all can, uh, just be fast-forwarded. Okay, so there's one side, um, installed and once we get the dirt pushing against it you know they're not going to go anywhere so those bolts are mainly just for when we're going down the road okay so got these cut um no there's the other um so this is how it's going to be mounted it's not going to be mounted to this piece it's going to be mounted to this piece so um but this is just so i can show you so I'm going to drill three three-eighths holes here for some three-eighths carriage bolts, and that's going to be like that, okay? And then I'm going to get a barrel bolt, and I'll drill a hole in the steel or the wood, wherever it ends up, um, and that will be used to hold this piece, this piece up um, whenever there's not dirt or, you know, just just to kind of lock it in so that way it ain't flopping everywhere so uh, I gotta go get some bolts and barrel bolts so I'll be back okay so I got my pieces drilled um, as you can see there are gonna go like this and um okay so I went and got some bolts and some barrel bolts if it'll focus so there you can see and um I got my piece drilled oh there you can see the three holes in it I don't know why this camera is making this lighting like this but anyway so I'm gonna put it on here and spot through the holes and bolt the uh the angle iron pieces um on both sides um, so I just undid the two bolts and then took it off. So I'll do that and then I'll get back to you. Okay, so as you can see, I got the uh, angle iron all bolted on there. And, um, you know, the carriage bolts are sticking through. So um, I'm going to cut the uh, excess threads off of there it's just so I can have a longer uh, uh, board right there. Um that's really the only reason and then I'll clean it up and then um, I'll bolt these side pieces back on so let me get all that done and uh, we'll get back to you okay so there it is uh, once again that lighting I don't really know what's happening here but anyway it's it's done it's good it's nice and solid so as you can see it's moving the trailer um, let me show you what I did on the inside here so, over there, you can see a barrel bolt, and there's another one on, 
on this side um, right down there. So I just use that for securing you know, it this way and um, it, work, it works really good. So you know there's kind of a little circle shot but anyway so and there you can see the barrel bolt on that side so um, it was finished it only cost us about sixty dollars um, we could have used two by tens but since we're um, okay let's see if it'll okay so down here on the edge of our trailer we're gonna build a little in another video we're gonna build uh, a bar that the, these angle irons you know the, the ones that we did here we can use them for ramps so we're gonna build a bar there and I'll weld that on so that's why we went with the 2x12s um, so anyway there it is all finished up and it only took me about maybe four hours so not too hard Okay, so after a few uh, trial runs with our trailer going and getting some rock for where it washes out around the shed and things, uh, we figured out that these uh, barrel bolts isn't as good as we thought they was going to be. Um, they kind of, I can see here, they've already bent and everything. And uh, when we were going to get the rock to first load, we had this thing barrel bolted in the uh, back of the trailer and it flew out on the side of the road, so we had to turn around and go get it. So uh, we figured some longer barrel bolts, or uh, better yet, the gate latches, the ones that you can slide over, and they kind of got a little hook like that. So those would work better. But other than that, another good project. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next video.